Welcome, this is Crusader Kings 3 and I'm the Emperor. I'm so glad you're here. We're playing the Iranian Intermezzo and we're doing fairly well. We're building up to become the Empire of Persia eventually in all of this. We're live streaming over on Twitch. So if you want to join, check out the Twitch, give a follow. And if you're new here on the YouTubes, leave a subscription, leave a comment, leave a like. And let's get into it. I like to try and explain what I'm doing while I'm doing it, and chat does get a say in what we're doing. So that's usually making for some fun choices. Right now, chat has demanded, demanded, and I agree, that we finish up consolidating what belongs to our kingdom. So this little bitty up here is still part of our kingdom, and pieces of Hothtun are uh, of our kingdom. So we could just seize the whole shike them there, but we're we're facing some stiff opposition out here. So we need to be a little bit careful, especially since we're kind of low on funds. So we might not actually start those wars. You need to get the vassal combined. Uh, let's marry off your daughters. I don't have that many daughters left who are not married, I believe. But let's check through them. All right, I forgot that doesn't work here. The back button. Okay, we have one daughter left. Now I tend to go for alliance power, but I think all of these are internal. Like, I don't think we're gonna get much outside of the realm anymore. Okay, this is outside the realm, but it's it's very small. If it even is outside the realm. I don't know. I can't tell. Oh, from here I can't. Okay, it's, it's way, way, way away. That's the strongest thing we can get. And then there's this and this is part of the realm. So that doesn't really matter for us. Could go for this guy. I mean, he's robust. Question is, will he go matrilineal? No, he will not. So we only get this option there. Do we need to go matrilineal? Not necessarily. We can just go like that. It's our best option right now. So we're gonna go with this. It's funny that... Can't do anything here, but... Alright. We don't need to. Uh, we should hold court. Let's go do that. Let's hope it doesn't cost us any money. Come up. Come up. Uh, and it would immediately cost us money. What do you want? Ooh, that's a good commander slash knight. He gets the Valia of Derbent. That's north. Who currently holds this? One of our blood. Nah. Okay, let's spend all the money we have. Let's spend all the money we have and get this guy in court. People are gonna be unhappy. All of our knights are kind of insulted over this. But so it goes. Let's see, what do you want? Popular opinion goes down, control growth goes up. Yeah, we'll get him married in a moment. Saruz, see what you can do. What's going on here? Heretics at large. Peaceful coexistence is always the best solution. Six court grandia is there. And 150 prestige. And only our Amira loses a little bit of our opinion. Ah, I don't care. Peaceful coexistence is always the best solution. We are generous after all. That makes sense. We're done with holding court. So now we give the peasant... Pheasant... Pheasant lad. Okay. Uh, he has exactly one option. And he's gonna get exactly that option. <laughs> I'm not even messing about here. So I don't want to announce our opposition there. You want to give me 10 gold for this man? Have it. Have it for sure. Mm. 
Okay, who do we dedicate that book for that we paid out of our nose? Only God guides me. Let's go. Let's check out dungeon chat says. Okay. God, you all play this game so much quicker than me, honestly. I'm just kind of moseying through things here. Want to give me 50 gold to be free? Sure. I don't know who you are, so... Okay, let me ransom people first and then... Okay, what do you want from our prisoners? Should we try and make us some uh, commanders? Now, this guy tried to kill our, our wife. He, he stays. Could try and get this guy to be our commander. He's actually pretty good, but he's a lunatic, so... <laughs> I see. Negotiate release. Convert. Recruit. And we'll just wait for him to accept so we can go and... Uh, give him a wife, maybe. And of course that doesn't work, so now I have to find him later. No problem. So let's see, who else is a... Uh, this guy is a halfway decent commander, but not a good knight. I'm looking more for knights right now. I'm my very best commander, I don't need that. Oh, he's very learned though. Would make for a good physician. Eh. Ah, nah, I'm fine. We we got one guy out. That that's that has to be enough for the moment. So where is our lad? There's our lad. And you can have exactly one spouse. Low chance, but we'll take it. Okay, our money is growing back. So I say we take this guy up here. And we'll go for a seizing of the du jour duchy, which doesn't give us the duchy title, and he becomes our vassal. If we don't du jour siege, seize, it does. So we just conquer this thing. Why not? We we do have the piety for it, so let's just conquer that thing. Then we can give the title to someone we want. Not have it be, be this weird situation. Speaking of weird situations... Like this guy we de jure conquered, so... He's not someone we appointed there. Oh, we don't like that. Let's raise our troops. I mean, we got this nice wall going on here. Let's just hope they raise quick enough to fight this thing. I like how they kind of start sliding. Why am I not leading this? I always should be leading this. Okay, so let's check something in a moment. We already spent so much on it, we're definitely going to spend more to increase the artifact power. Let's go. Ah, uh, quality always. So, okay, it says defending a river crossing, but we are a strategist. So, crosses rivers to trace without advantage penalties. Yes, our learning increased by one, which doesn't matter for this man. <laughs> so we shouldn't have the river crossing disadvantage. And as we can see, We do not have that disadvantage at all. But he's a very competent ruler in his own right. So we are we are equal commanders facing each other. Yet the better man won. A betrothed to our daughter has passed away. That's a shame. Let's get you hooked. 
hitched. And these are just our nephews again. Mm. Intelligent. Sounds good. Herculean sounds better. Let's get the Nepali in here. Let's get some buttery traits here. Oh, God. Oh! Health medium boost. That is crazy good. Like, the quality overall that thing is horrible. But a medium boost from a book? Now, you don't get to see that every day. I am actually impressed. I am actually quite impressed. We have also this popping up all the time. What What is it? What What do we have? I thought that was before. Okay, well, fine. So, we put up the book. So, now we constantly, continually have a medium health boost. The theoretically, anyway. Sturdy Galen. That, that is the book. Grow up so fast. Lovely. Let's get some betrothals finished up here. Look at him. Look at him. Proud step warrior coming here. Wait a moment. Countering light footman. And you are countering only the light horse. How do we counter horse archers? How do we counter that? What counters horse archers? Counters light, cavalry, heavy infantry, archers. So I would think just these. Yeah. I think light horsemen is what... What counters these. It's a little bit. Okay. A little bit odd, but okay. We'll take it. So I'm... I'm impressed that Kazaria so far hasn't really looked at attacking us. So, I'm kind of happy about that. That they haven't looked south yet. Okay. Nephews. Cousins. So, so many options. Let's give it to the robust boy here. Our cousin. Give it to the person who controls the other county. This one? Yeah. Sure. Maybe maybe he creates a duchy title. That's a, that's a good point. Very good point. Usury against unity. Valir Rostam approaches me, seemingly concerned. I've heard of uh, Valir Rostam is lending money to courtiers in financial uh, trouble. Feeding of the m misfortune with the exorbitant interest rates. No, 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 no. We imprison him, our cousin. Share all our ill getting gains and we can forget about it. <laughs> no, we're generous, so we're not going to take that. Sounds like something to work out between ourselves, between yourselves. No. Let them work it out between themselves. I like my unity high. Our clan unity will be high. Okay, Armenia, you said Armenia is attacking? In the Alanian conquest of Klaje. I don't think they were attacking. I think they were being eaten by Kazaria. Can I demand a hostage? Oh, I actually can demand the hostage, but he's like, no. Have you heard of a little thing called no? <laughs> so we might eventually have to face them. Let's check. What What is his army made up of? Okay, lots of force archers, which we cannot can, uh, counter at the moment. That is kind of bad. I could just look for hooks here. In the Karganet. Okay, let's try. Let's try.
Let's try and look for hooks. Okay, let's check the Iranian intermezzo thing again. Iranian resurgence is kind of what we're looking for. We control at least 30% of the Persian Empire. We are still at 16%. Our fame isn't high and we don't have two... We don't have 14 Iranian heritage counties yet. So we still need to grow. We're already pretty big, but we're not big enough. Can make it so we don't have war. What's going on? Hamam Havok. No, I stand by my family members, whatever the versions they engage in. Who are you? You are not you're not even of my family. What do you want? You're my court physician, sure, but Go away. How's unity? Have you not watched Fast and the Furious? It's about family. I'm not going to go further into Armenia, although it's a little bit of an attractive goal. It's also a very dangerous goal, because Kazaria might just go gobble us up, and I don't, I don't want to... I don't want to be eaten up by Kazaria. Oh, look at them. Having their little, little crisis. Oh, 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 okay. Uh, serve the crown. We don't need that. Stalwart leader. We constantly lead in battle. So let's reduce the risk of commanding armies. Let's go with that. We could go for BAM. And be just like, BAM. That's ours now. 5,000. Okay. Who are your allies? I think some of these are mine. Ah, yes. Please come in. I know some. none of these are mine. Interesting. Where's this guy? Hmm. No idea. Let's see. What else can we take around here? Yeah, let's let's take all the border regions with the with these guys there. Let's let's do all that. Show the Vali. Come on in. Say hello. What sponsorship? He wants to go to Persia. He's considered master by his peers. We have good and bad results of this. I need money. But I also need things. It is a capitalist struggle. <sighs> Let's sponsor another one. This time I'm not recruiting him though. I learned my lesson. And back down. Gotta spend the money to make money, don't you know? So this guy has no allies. So, okay. So, okay. This is actually an interesting option. Because if we go for the Kingdom of Persia, we do not get the title because it's not created. So we just get the territory. Okay, someone has an incestuous... I don't care. I don't think that was a relevant one. Uh, so we... Do not get the title, we get the territory associated. Gain the firm hand perk. I mean, 5% chance, nothing is gonna happen. Let's go. Nope, we didn't get it. <laughs> so that would actually be pretty good. Like, that gets us a Good load of stuff here. Okay, the inspiration is funded. I don't know what these options might go. 
Yeah, the other kingdom title is the problem that we would get that one. And we are not an empire yet, so that doesn't help us. Uh, so, let's see. I want to possess something truly unique. It gives you hot, the relic will be. It doesn't actually tell us. Like, truly unique. A skull or a hide. A skull or a hide, okay, that makes sense. That's easy. But the rest, I don't know. Makes me wish I would dare. I'll just go with something truly unique. Okay. So we could also go for a holy war for the kingdom here. I think that would be much more worthwhile because it's such a bigger slice of the pie. You know, there's just a lot more territory at once. Then again, I think we can just do that for the duchy as well. We don't even have to... Oh, no, no, no. Okay, they have still a little piece there, so... We'd have to go holy war for the entire kingdom. I think we shall. What religion are they? Okay, they're completely alone. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, it's Shahan, the virgin culture. I don't care. Virgin cultures. Preposterous. What is it now? Oh, another one. Another master. Why are there so many masters in this? I'm impressed. Alliance expired. Not a super important one. So we can live with it. Oh yes, another martial perk. Do we become an aggressive attacker? Or do we go with logistician? Supply duration plus 100%. Attrition taken in mountains down. Desert attrition. Uh, desert mountains attrition. I mean, that's not bad. But I think we're going to go with aggressive attacker because we tend to attack a lot. And this gives us stress because it kind of doesn't work with us because we are impatient. So this works much better with us. We keep attacking and we're impatient, so. We'll go with this. By Allah, I hope he doesn't have to fight one. Slightly higher quality. I don't know what gains to progress means, honestly. Like, is that two progress bits here? I assume it is. So he successfully avoids the leopards or he gets eaten by them. <laughs> he might become wounded, he might become maimed. Oh. But slightly higher quality. I think we're going to go with the slightly higher quality. I mean, he might become maimed, but... That's a risk I'm willing to take for him. The artifact... Slightly higher quality. Okay, it worked. So we got one progress. And slightly higher quality. Nice. So do we have hooks here now? Do I have a hook on you? Oh, I actually... Oh, I actually do. How does that work? So first I blackmail him. Which then gives us the hook. But that also makes him dislike us. So he might just decide to go kill us. So let's go blackmail him. Which he is fine with. So now what I could do is arrange a marriage. Except... There's no one to do that with. I could demand hostages. And use the hook for that. So I could go pick this little child here. And even with the hook, he does not care whatsoever. <laughs> uh, so exposing the secret wouldn't help us. 
So I don't know exactly what this helps us at the moment. I don't think it helps us at all. We could offer guardianship to one of his kids. Like I'm like, okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna train your boy. But he still kind of hates us, so... Maybe we start swaying the man. Because I am afraid of them. And right, rightly so. I mean, look at them. Kazaria is insanely big. Oh, the Holy Roman Empire already exists. Alright, 10,000. Okay, and Leon is taking over most of Castile. Alright. I haven't even looked around in the world yet. It's interesting what happens around you. And I love that it doesn't necessarily have to matter. Like, you can ignore most of it. But you can also engage with it. It's very fun. How's Unity changed? Okay, there's a secret lover up there. How did I house Unity change? No, it's still fine. All good. Nothing changed. Don't scare me. Life is an adventure. Explore the area for artifacts. He gets opinion and higher quality. Let's go higher quality. What about Africa? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna take a look. Well, Africa is kind of a mess. Yeah, this is just a mess. Let's be honest. There's nothing interesting going on in Africa. They grow up so fast. Adequate bargainer. Let's go. More marriages. How long is this truce? When does our truce end? And of course it's not being shown. Our truce ends in 19 months. Can we take these guys on in 19 months? I mean, they have a lot of troops. Especially through their... Wait. Ah, Haftoon. That's that's what we want to attack. Uh, whoops. Seize this. What what else can we do here? Conquer a duchy. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Just gonna seize the jour. Six thousand three hundred. I mean, it's basically fighting this whole block down there. And we need only one or two allies to fight it. I say we go for it. We set out to do that. Chat decided we want to do it, so do it. We shall. Question though, money. Nah, it's fine. We're gonna be fine. Let's get our allies in here. Oh, we can vassalize a guy. Oh, we can vassalize our ally. Interesting. But we kind of need him for this war, so... No vassalization yet, but later. <laughs> first, first come and help in the war. Then maybe we vassalize you. For now, I need you to fight. Um... Yeah, we would still have the alliance if we vassalize him, but we cannot call our vassals into war as our allies. That doesn't work. So he would then start contributing his troops, but it wouldn't be nearly as much as he gives through directly being involved. All right, let's go. So the funny thing is about the aggressive attacker trade, as long as we are attacking his stuff... So if he comes to defend this, we are still the attacker. So this works even if we don't necessarily go into attack but are sieging. Our sway scheme ends because that guy just died. <laughs> oh no. Ah oh, boy. Will you give me a hostage? Well he's not as disinclined to it. Let's just sway the guy. Let's just go. Let's just be friendly with the Khans. 
What fort level is this? Six. Keep laying low. We will move on eventually. Now, what's going on here? No guts, no glory. Make them pay for wasting my time. And this gives us higher quality. 27% for higher and 64% for slightly higher. We're going to go with this one. It's bound to give us a slightly or higher quality improvement on this. So, um, go fight him. And he fought and he got wounded, but slightly higher quality. So, totally worth it. So, why is this fourth level too high at level six? Seems a little bit counterintuitive, but that's okay. Our allies are approaching. And we would get a nice little buffer zone around our capital. With these nice mountain ranges. That are then a defensive position for us, kind of. I like it. It's a good spot to have. We should find him a wife. Maybe we can ally him. Uh, no. Nah, it's nothing. Like We have literally nothing. Nothing we can do. So where is he going? Is he going to attack my capital? Maybe. Well, our enemy's ally is engaged in a battle with a hostile troop or something. Someone left the prison. Naib left the prison. I don't know who that is. It's a vassal of my vassal. What is going on here? These are all our enemies. All of this is our enemy. Does he have allies that are hating each other? No, he has only one ally. I don't know what's going on here. The color scheme says both of these both of these are enemy armies. Okay, no, one of them is hostile. Alright. So his allies were just completely destroyed in the south. Well, not completely, but close enough, you know. This siege will take 10 months, so we have easy time to kill this off and then defend our capital. We have made it far on this ruler. Far. Look at this. 41. He's the oldest of all the lads. That is on the inspirational mission. Courtier. Ah, alright. But that's not our courtier. That's a guest. I didn't recruit that one. The last ruler, he died in his sleep on a ship. Because he was malnourished. He came back from a wedding. That's how he died. <laughs> he died on a ship. Yep, that was exactly my reaction. That was exactly my reaction to it all. Uh, nope. That's not how it works. Oh! Yes. 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 This tattered flag is said to be the legendary banner that the Persian blacksmith Cave made for his apron to rally his people against their evil overlord. Yeah, we got a little bit of popular opinion. It's not bad, but I'm looking mainly at the monthly renown and the army gold maintenance. The prestige is also big. Big news. That is lovely. And we get the banger music for it as well. Okay, let's hope our ally doesn't immediately abandon his siege there because I'm moving my arm. Yeah, of course. 
And we're gonna go for Chivalric Dominance. I mean, doing fine on Court Artifacts. Don't get me wrong, Artifacts are coming in big time here. That is really neat. Music is so good! Come on now. And we got a nice hostage out of this one. 50% hostage. Oof. What are you? Are you an heir or something? Oh, he's a sibling. Seriously, I need to get a grip on how to get uh, music that is similar to Crusader Kings 3 background music and just have a playlist, play that up and down. Similar to, because Crusader Kings music is Crusader Kings for me, so I, I like it when I play the game, right? But something similar would, would be so cool. It'd be so good. What if this betrothed can be married in Grand Wedding? Did someone promise that nonsense? I sure didn't. Oh, I did promise that. Uh, <laughs> um, I have a feeling I might not have 400 goals in three years. Yeah, we should absolutely ransom some prisoners soon. I mean, maybe should, we should switch our focus as well to get some hooks in. With how many family members we have, there should be many, many hooks to be cashed in on. So we should be rich, basically. I think, honestly, that's what we're going to do. We're going to switch to uh, stewardship just for a little bit. Just for a little bit. And we're going to take the income uh, plus percent. We only want golden obligations. Because if we look at our hooks, honestly... Like, we have 51 weak hooks. 51. Let's go blackmail some people. Okay. I'm gonna reveal your secret. Let's go blackmail some people. And that's our war finished. Let's disband. Let's train our commanders. And now let's vassalize the guy. I mean, sure, why not? Okay, no exception. He only wants to come if he can be his religion. And he doesn't get that for sure. We can station a regiment. Cool. Where? Uh, up there. So up there, we station it in our little church. And now we want to go and ransom our prisoners. We don't have all that many, but I'll just try. Let's see what comes in. We have 120 gold right now. I think we're just getting hooks. And this guy is our rival now. So we got no money. Oh. Maybe you could help me with this. 100 lifestyle. Let's go. We want to finish this up. We only want one thing. 
So we have to stick with it for five years, so that's something to consider. Honestly, with the income that we have, maybe... Maybe we should go ahead and set our counselor also to adding this. Don't we have someone better for this? Yes, but... Oh, actually... But not a strong vassal. He's a strong vassal. And he's my son and heir, so... Let's put him in here. Just until we got this grand wedding business taken care of. Oh. 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 What happened here? Was this not a bigger thing? Okay, but these are all allied down there. How dare you all be so friendly with one another? <laughs> it's, it's not okay, but we could take another big chunk. Or we take the... Uh, I mean, that chunk is the better chunk. It has three things instead of two things. But that's a war again that costs us money. Okay, let's let's finish the money thing. For once, we're gonna save money. We're not gonna go into the next war. We're gonna save. So our wealth focus only really cancels out the the being generous. Where do we need to be with our court grand yet? By now, ah, we're perfectly fine. We don't need to spend more. Command improved, love to hear it. Still swaying the con. Would you like to give me a hostage now? <laughs> no. Ah, darn. The problem is the different religions. Like getting stuff gone done with peoples of different re religions. That was a little bit difficult. I mean, it's very tempting, but I don't want to give him exemptions. And right now, he's more useful as an outside ally. I love this war. I really like it. It's gonna be good for me. Oh, look at that. Some grand twins. Let's go for Hassan and Turan. Or an ancestor. Hassan and Sabah. May you grow strong and wise. Oh, look at them. Beautiful. Let's get you... Another beautiful one. Are we... I tend to not to want to marry these off. Because once they're succession... And you have married all the children off to random people just for traits and stuff... And all your children on your new character are basically unavailable for marriage. That is a little bit painful. Like, you're gonna feel that one. So I'm never quite sure if that's a good idea. And I tend to err on the side of caution. Oh, you have 5,000 soldiers? That is crazy. I emphasize with those shared interests. I try to main subtlety. 30 opinion gain or a chance of 50 opinion gain and 75 prestige. Let's go with the chance. Ah, nice. It worked out. Got the opinion and everything. Plus 12 per month. Plus 12 per month. What? Oh, money. Oh, yes. Whoa. Okay, that's, that's coming in. That's pouring in now. But we only have two years left to earn what we need, so I don't know. Okay, so the court physician generally suggests a course of uh, doing something. So, you seem to be under the weather, my lord. If, if 
I, I, I know a fair number of suitable random years, so it doesn't sound too bad. Uh, do no more than what is necessary. No, no experimental stuff. Excellent work, Saru's. We're feeling all right, a little bit better. Low country, uh, county control in Quam. Yeah. Oh, why? Ah, it's not bad. What do you want? It's not even red. It's just slightly the color of dried blood. That can't mean anything bad. What do you mean? It's crazy. We should just take Baghdad and make that our new capital, honestly. That's by far the highest development around here. Wait a moment. I think we can actually go take Baghdad. <laughs> you know what time it is? It's, it's time to move capital once again. <laughs> Uh, let me let me think. Yeah, no, absolutely. Absolutely, we need to take Baghdad. That is a plum. A ripe plum. Let's bring in our friend from the south. Our not yet, but eventually vassal. And bring in this guy as well. And this guy as well, because they cost very little to bring in. Early on conquering stuff to put a new headquarters, I like it. Ah yes, bring the Valai in. Thank you so much. Excellent, excellent. All of our friends are joining. I'm gonna march down there and I will personally lead my troops. We have done so before, we're gonna do it again. Successfully, might I add. Okay, we can't just march in, we're gonna get attritioned. So we have to kind of siege our way through here. But it's fine, he might just attack us or try and to attack our allies or something. So I don't mind if he's walking around there. Problem is, if we switch over to stability now, to stabilization, does that mean our war has to end? I don't quite know that. I know you can't start a new war, but will it end a war is my question. Now, let's speed this along. We're just looking at sieges again for a little bit. This guy should organize so we can maybe earn some money still. I don't think we can do this. This will be a non sequitur. We're not gonna get that done. Another grandson, and he will be a Muhammad. Okay, he's hunting our ally there, which I don't appreciate. The ruling of the realm surely interests him. What is he? Subdiffusion and uh, intrigue. That's what he wants. That's what he's up to. Okay, our enemy has stopped moving. So we rejoined the siege. That didn't work. He's not... In His whole character is about subdiffusion and intrigue, but he's not into it. Not enough. So what happens when this fails? We'll see. I'm glad to be Bell again. We're no longer sick. Perfect. So we've taken that. I mean, not us personally, but our ally did. So unless he fights us... We should be good here. With another siege. Please, please, please let me finish this before stabilization starts. Come on, come on, come on. 
Yep, 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 yep. Maybe just in time. Oh. Baghdad! Yes! Usually I don't go for these things where it's like, oh, you want to have that thing? Oh, yeah, we're gonna raise control for sure. But first, move Realm Capital to Baghdad. That is not even a question. Not even for a single second. We're gonna lose some income for, for the moment. That's not a problem. Let's give away some stuff. Oh, all these are so rich. I want to keep all this. Okay, what, what is the jour here? Let's see, what, what is the jour of Baghdad? This thing. So all this here. Okay, so I'd, I'd rather keep everything down here. Because that is rich and powerful. Like, this is great. All of what we have at the moment is kind of horrible compared. So we're just gonna go give everything else away. <laughs> Uh, how are our tax jurisdiction? Okay, we have a problem. We have four untaxed vassals right now. Uh, uh, Who is untaxed? Assign new taxpayers. Okay, these are unassigned. So I can give him these. So right now we have the problem that basically we have all our taxpayers in. So now we need to create some stronger vassals. So let's check. This thing here... The Duchy of Raij. So we're gonna give this thing to either the holder of that. Who is this lad or the ruler of that. So he might create that duchy for himself. So he gets it. Okay, next. Next of our old, older holdings. Now Tabriz is kind of cool, but these two we're gonna give away. And, okay, let's give away our church first. We're gonna lose some income, but don't you worry about it. Can only give it to our cousin. No problem. Give it to our cousin. Now we're gonna give this away. Now this is a, this is a barony, so that doesn't matter who we give it to. We're just gonna give it to someone as well. Like a nephew or something. Who cares? Have it. And now we're gonna give this whole thing away to someone who's around there. Someone who has a claim to this duchy which we're currently holding. And we can we can create the whole duchy, but we need to give it to someone who can actually control it. So we're gonna give it to him. He gets this. And he gets the duchy title. The Shadam of Azerbaijan. He gets that whole thing. Wait, am I giving him both? Okay, he only gets the Shadam of Azerbaijan. So he gets all that. Does it belong? That belongs to him as well. So we will go ahead and... Now oh, wait a moment. Didn't we take this? Huh? <laughs> we did take this. Alright. Might have passed outside of the realm. You can lose something for low control? Yeah, okay, I didn't know that. Um, anyhow... Where is it? Grand Vassal. We can have this fool. It's all good. So you're a pretty strong lad now. That's okay. There's some infighting going on over here, maybe? Doesn't matter. Okay, so we need to either give something away. Or... Let's see. So Baghdad right now is all this, this is this, this is that. So which of these is the worst one? <laughs> Iskaf I think is the worst one. I mean relatively speaking. 
just going by size. But then again, wait, let, let's let's have a quick look here. We are still pushing gavel kind, so 13 years. If we can hold it for 13 years, it's fine. So we lost our steward here. Because our son is currently vassal to someone else, I don't know. We could put this guy in. Again, he's not the best, but he's a strong vassal. Might as well. So our money will bounce back in a moment. I hope. At the moment, with the low control, like all this takes a takes a second. Okay, what's going on here? Wasid is attacking us for Baghdad. I fully understand this uh, choice, though it is a foolish move for sure. Oh no, our alliance died. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. It's not a foolish move anymore. Okay, let's let's find a new alliance real quick if we can. Yeah, there might be still a daughter unmarried around here. I don't know which one, but maybe. Maybe we still have one. Do we still have one? I wish it was easier to tell. Let's check here. Uh, in our courtiers, courtiers. Let's go with Dynasty Sassanende. Okay, I don't think we can, uh, through grandchildren, we can't get alliances. So they don't matter much. Nope. No one left. Okay. Mm. Let's check through our siblings, maybe. Nope. Let's check up here if we can't marry someone. Okay. Okay, that's a problem for us now. And I cannot negotiate an alliance either. Okay, that is actually a big problem. Um why We have this ally up here. This is who gives you that power. Okay. Time for mercenaries on our end, if we can even afford some. And yeah, we can afford these guys. <laughs> That's all we can afford. Some bowmen. Uh, holy orders don't exist. So we can only get the... Oh, and they're not good against heavy infantry, are they? They're good against skirmishes. I think we have to. Yeah, we can't afford horsemen. Doesn't matter. We can only afford these guys. So these guys it shall be. So these guys are not our direct enemy. So we do have a chance. Like if we can catch him and win against him personally. Why is this guy supposedly better than us? 
So if we can kill him here. Oh no, why is this why is this an equal fight? Oh, why is this an equal fight? Why is this an equal fight? More men at arms counter. Okay, you know what? Oh, I can't. <laughs> All right. So, um, may the gods be in our favor. Inshallah now. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this one. Oh, my bad feeling is not coming true. We're actually winning this one. We lost the sun, though. Let's become rivals with this guy. How dare you. How dare you kill my son. Okay, but we soundly beat them. Like, that was a big defeat for him. <gasps> Yo! Hello! Allah! Uakbar! <laughs> Allah is great! He is with us! Gimme that! Gimme that! Do I want the hostage though? He's gonna pay for the grand wedding! Yo! Let's go! <laughs> Whoop! That was amazing. Do I want the hostage? Chat, do I want the hostage? Or do we not care? Because I'd rather go attack him and take him out. And hostage makes it a little bit harder. Take the hostage, we take the hostage. Chat says take the hostage, we take the hostage. Yo! Yo! <laughs> and we got the money for the mercenaries back in. Oh my god, look at all this popping up. Oh my god, let's let's have this. And we'll have it in Baghdad. And we'll make it <laughs> kind of cheap. We're gonna save money. I don't care what you people think of us. I want my ill-gotten gains. Caravan master, we don't need any of that. So who are we even marrying? Our player heir and son to this. Who are you? Why is this a grand wedding? I don't understand. But that was crazy. That was absolute. Oh no, they. Oh, okay. They just got schlopped up by the Abbasid Empire. Okay. All right now. <laughs> right there. No, no, no. They are part of it. They, they came from here. Like this guy. This guy attacked us. He wasn't part of it. Was he? You sure? No, they were part of it. Okay, cool. Okay, 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 okay. You're more attentive than me. I concede. They probably were part of it. Nice. Nice. Come on now, that was fantastic. That worked super well in our favor. Do we have any taxpayers that are not paying? That was fantastic. Okay, let's try and consolidate our our place here. Can't declare war because, of course, we have the royal wedding now going on. But I want to close the gap here. I want to take all this, just slurp it up to have a land bridge between our our capital and everything else. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What an absolutely fantastic event. 
That was so good. Let me check if I can... If you manage domain... Ah, it doesn't help us just enough. Go back to assisting then. <laughs> Ooh. Patronage would help? Okay, explain. How, how would patronage help here? It's plus four. I know, I'm lo I, I was just looking for the main limit. I I don't care. This doesn't help us with domain limit. Like, if we wanted to go for the height, it would be court politics, but this doesn't help us with domain limit, does it? Ah, uh, well, it would help in speeding up the research. That's true. That's a very good point. Helps us get stuff faster. It's true. Masa Abbasid became our hostage. My good girl. Let me let me go and influence you to be impatient. <laughs> nah, you you shall be generous. And I shall not murder you. But I would like to educate you. Uh it's my gift that you are generous. And where is she? I will educate you. We could marry her off with what we got. Now, I don't think we can marry her off, can we? No, nah, we're not allowed to marry her off. And the royal wedding, we already got, we got that going. But I don't think we can attack actually at the moment because we're in a stabilization. So right now we can't go for wars internally here. You can only fight external, I think. Our sister died? Oh, yeah. That is yet another alliance going down the river. Oh, boy. I mean, mysterious circumstances aren't all that mysterious. It was murder. It always is. But he likes us well enough, so I'm not so scared of them anymore. We could swear fealty to him. But that would make Persia as an empire much harder. Okay, I can't wait to pay for this, which I didn't want to pay for. I'm ashamed of myself. This is the best option, and it works with our character traits. So we're gonna go with the temperate option here. Let's go. Ah, finally, golden obligations. Okay, let the money rain in. We're gonna go back to strategy focus as soon as we can. I can still salvage the situation, sure. It happens. Now we're gonna go with this. Okay, 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 okay. So now we should be able to Demand 14 payments. <laughs> let's go. Oh no, how soon it goes down hard with this. Okay, let's be careful about this. Let's only get the ones that give us like 50 gold. Oh, we should also create an accolade, honestly. Um, let's see what accolades could we create. You're fairly young. I don't care too much about these. Hasty Duda, that's not great. Martial lifestyle experience plus 50%, that's pretty good. Stalwood, don't care. This is fine. Valiant, oof, yes. Tactician and Valiant, that's a great accolade to have. Experience and army damage, ooh, yes, thank you. Let's go, let's create that thing. Do we have a successor for you? Ugh. Nah, that's too expensive. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, should we go with religion's exemption on this guy? I don't think so. So do we have anyone who we can exploit without lowering our unity? Oh, we're generous. I remember, we're generous. 
I forget. Uh, let's see. Irritable. Let's go with flagellant. Our tiny health penalty will be offset. Little bit of prowess loss is fine. We have enough. So we just, we just, we just go flagellates. And our court physician will take care of that. Okay, yeah, that's a that's a big problem here. We can make titles now. Yes, you are you are very correct. We should also make titles, honestly. Uh, the one title that we definitely want is the duchy here. So this duchy. Oh, that's the kingdom of Mesopotamia. Uh, no, 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 not the kingdom of Mesopotamia. I want to usurp this thing, which I cannot do right now. I'm just so proud of the child. I can't usurp this because fighting a war. Aye, aye. Okay, let's see. Who could we, who could we reasonably put into a duchy up there? Who could we reasonably... Ah, I could transfer this guy. I don't want that. <laughs> What's going on here? Like, what duchy is this? Ah, that's a that's the Duchy of Dalam. That's simple. Doesn't help us much, but it's so expensive though. <laughs> Let's find a bigger duchy. One that, that holds more people. That's one. That's two. Nah. Nah. Not making titles yet. Let's get some more gold in. Okay, what we're gonna do, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this guy on finding some secrets somewhere. Uh, let's see. Down here at the Abbasid Court. And then we can potentially extort people down there. So it's not gonna stress us out. It's still gonna stress us out. But it's not gonna lower our, our house unity here. Which we have a fairly decent amount of. But I think I'd rather invest the money in our in our buildings for now. Okay, Masa is no longer our hostage. Not sure why. Praise the party. Praise the happy couple as expected. Let's lose some stress here. We'll lose some stress. Make it short and sweet. Okay, let's upgrade stuff. Let's build stuff. Let's 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 go. We upgrade this for sure. More strength, more money. Let's go. Okay, so these two here we don't get anything out of right now. I'm assuming due to low control. Yeah, these are all low control. Horribly low control. It's a big problem. Maybe we're working on it, but... <gasps> Dynasty Legacy. Squire Traditions. Monthly lifestyle. Martial experience plus 10%. Dynasty members are less likely to die or get wounded in battle and have higher chance of gaining prowess serving as knights. Uh, I think yes. I think yes. It's still what we're doing. We're mainly, we're mainly fighting stuff. We're mainly hitting people. So I think we're gonna keep going there. We, we've been very warlike. We've been very, very warlike. So I think that makes sense. Okay. Our mother. Low control, yep. Yeah. Let's see. I'm uh, focused on the actual entertainment. Now we're gonna go with this. Get some lifestyle experience, potentially some. Yeah, 300 CR chip. It's kind of no brainer. 
Though we want to switch back from stewardship soon. Oh, someone becomes our best friend. Or we become the trade we get the trade confider. That's actually really strong. Uh, that helps us with stress redu reduction and loss. So I think we're gonna go with that. We're gonna skip out on the friend. Gonna get confider instead. And now we can go get some opinion and stress loss or just nuke our stress from orbit. A little bit of stress we can deal with. So I think we're gonna go with some opinion and some stress. He wants to forge a brooch, but he's only decent, so no. Shut up. <laughs> Snooty for 15 years. Works because we're impatient. We're gonna go with the impatient one because it fits our character best. So what's going on here? Nothing. We're still on the activity. I'm kind of anxious to consolidate the realm down there. Stewardship experience, stewardship experience, stress relief and prestige. We don't need stress relief no more. So we're gonna go with our nephew and steward. That is more important. So the Vali and the stewardship experience. That's where we're gonna go. Ooh. We must keep in contact. We are family now. We increase our stewardship by one. We take it. Oh. Wait a moment. Now that our stewardship is plus one. Does it help? No. <laughs> Still not. Shame. So we keep on patronage. To help with that research. Tonight I must look to the pulpers of Baghdad. Lose some gold. Oh, we don't need the stress relief. The mosque will be quiet now. I'm meaning to talk to Hassan. Let's talk to Hassan. Let's get this wedding over with. Trust me, it's a good match. It's in Allah's hands now. That's what we feel like, for sure. Thank you all for coming. We gained 30 gold. And we're an eagle rev eager reverer now. We can hold court. Let's hold court. Let's see who's here. Let's see what they want. Please the peasants. Free labor. Plowshares to swords. Nah. I'll give you the funds and you can rebuild. I mean, we got the money on the ma on the on the stuff. Eager Reveler is one of those uh, traits that has levels. We'll check it out in a second. Let's finish the calling court. Gains weapons ban in cities for 50 years. Control growth. Every held country. We need the control growth. That's the thing. Like, we need that. We need that. We shall ban weapons within settlement walls. We need the control growth for sure. That works well for us. Makes Natil a uh, temple holding. I don't know what Natil is. Or where it is. We shall eradicate this blasphemous nonsense right now. Decreases some... Thing which I don't know where it is. Your cousin's vassal's primary title. I don't care. We'll just go with this. Yeah, we'll just we'll just go with this. My business here is done. Let's check out the eager reveler trait. Let's see, teach them the superiority of our culture. The culture in Karbala. I don't know where Karbala is down here. Let's go. 
maybe it works. I'm waiting for the pop-up here. Yep, worked. So we got Karbala to our our people. Okay, so Iga Revelra is right here. It gives some intrigue, some opinion, and it has levels. So if we go to level 2 eventually, we get some more. Right now with the basic, level 1 is what we need to go. Like we are level 0, we need we have we have a chance to get to level 2. It's just something the more you feast, the higher it is going to go. Basically. We should also probably promote culture, honestly. Switch this place over to Dalamite. How long will it take? 10 years. Let's go. Okay, we accomplished much tonight. And since this is a week where I have to get to work tomorrow, I will finish it here. Let's uh, finish off the YouTube watchers. If you're watching over on YouTube, you are the real thing. Thank you so much. Leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the Twitch as well. We stream Crusader Kings 3 twice per week, Mondays and Sundays. And Twitch chat, as you've seen, gets a lot to say. So if you want to help participate, help shape how we play this and help me learn things that I don't know or help answer questions, absolutely. If you got questions, leave them down in the comments. And thanks for watching. Bye, YouTube.